Do you want me drinking the tea? Yeah. Robert okay. Easton, the star of Spiritual Warriors. I wanted to ask you, um, what was the most, the most memorable experience during the shooting of Spiritual Warriors? I think for me, the most memorable thing, Jesu, was all the wonderful locations. Because we filmed all over Egypt and places that my wife Jude and I had been to before. We filmed Luxor, we filmed in the Cairo Museum, and then uh, going to Jordan and filming those wonderful places. Petra, that my wife and I had been to, brought back a lot of memories of places that we had been. Her health didn't permit her to go, but she had been there before, and I would phone her and tell her today we went to such and such a place that you remember. And then all the great locations here, filming at Prana, that uh, beautiful estate that used to belong to Busby Berkeley and the wonderful gardens, and filming up in Windermere, and the Goblin Valley, which I had not been to before. Such a wonderful, wonderful location in Utah. So uh, I think I remember, you know, with great fondness, all the wonderful locations that we shot in as our characters went to those places. It's been an honor and pleasure to work with you. And uh, so just to give us a quick, you know, a quick glance at your career. Uh, so you, you did 74 films and no, you're 74 years old? I'm 74 years old and this, Spiritual Warriors, is my 74th film. And uh, you go, you date way back to the days when they did uh, Painted Wagon and films like that. That's where you and June met? No. Oh. No, we met prior to that, and she and I both worked on Painted Wagon. By coincidence, you guys, you guys worked on that coincidentally? No. Oh. No, we, we were married, and in fact, uh, she came up to Oregon to visit me because I was on it for 19 weeks. And I said to them, hey, isn't there a part you 